Darth Nihilus was a Dark Lord of the Sith who lived about 4,000 years before the Battle of Yavin. In the final battle of the Mandalorian Wars, he was present for the catastrophic activation of the Mass Shadow Generator at Malachor V. The weapon killed nearly everyone on the planet, but left Nihilus alive. The experience changed him, and he began to crave Force Energies for sustenance. He was found by Darth Treya, who made him her apprentice alongside Darth Sion. As is the way of the Sith, Sion and Nihilus combined their forces to defeat Treya by severing her ties to the dark side. By this time, Nihilus's need for the Force had become so strong he was required to encase himself within his armor to stay alive. Together, he and Sion began a Jedi Purge and nearly exterminated the Jedi Order. During an attempt to absorb the life force of an entire Jedi Academy, Nihilus's ship was boarded by Mitra Sirik. She confronted and defeated the Sith Master while Mandalorian and Republic forces joined together to destroy his flagship, the Ravager. Although his body perished, his spirit remained in his armor, which was buried on Korriban. That's it for today. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share to see new Star Wars videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And if there's a specific Star Wars topic you'd like me to cover, please leave it in the comments, and I'll do an episode about it. Thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.